guys, here we are, out on the water once again. We're here with Ruben, he's over there in the background, on the shallows port. He's got a really nice boat, we're out here on a really nice day. Uh, it's beautiful. Maybe we got five to ten mile an hour winds, uh, busting out the murky water rods. Today with a little special guest, this is the Shimano SLX BFS reel with some Veribos line. We're gonna be testing that out today, so you guys stay tuned. It's gonna be good. We got reds, we got trout. It's gonna be a good day. Let's get it. Finally, first fish of the day. Trout. Got the bait. All right, there we go. Finally. Okay, guys, nice little trout. Hey, skinny little, skinny little guy. Let my hands here. Got it on the old gulp. There we go. Uh, using a little gulp jerk shad with the salty head weedless 3 16 Little guy uh, He's maybe 17 Maybe he's close All right guys, what is up and welcome back to another episode of fishing in Milligan Today we're busting out the murky water rod, the seven foot light action. We got it paired up with the Shimano BFS SLX. Veravos 20 pound braid and the old faithful gulp jerk shad. 20 pounds of motto and a salty head weedless hook. See what we could do out here. Busting out this brand new Shimano SLX BFS. And it's a really cool reel. All the way from Japan. Oh yeah, it's got the drag clicker, boys. It's got the drag clicker. Really good setup for throwing those ultra light lures. Your 1 16th ounce, all the way up to 1 8th, but really the sweet spot's that 1 16th. And uh, really nice compact reel, fits in your palm really nice. So, all the way from the shores of Japan, brought it over here to the shores of South Texas. Put it on a murky water rod, and here we go. I also got some really cool. Uh, Bugs fishing lures that uh, another YouTuber sent to me for a small fee. Uh, RX Angler, all the way from Galveston, Texas. So, really grateful to him for doing that for me. Is that one? No. So here we are. There you go. Oh. Hey, that was something. Maybe I'll come back for it.
Oh, I still have it. <laughs> what the heck happened? Oh my gosh. Guys, I have no idea what happened. <laughs> it just stopped really for a second. What the heck? That was weird. That was super weird. He wasn't going nowhere though. Jeez. Look at that. Look at that gulp. Straight down in. Oh, that was weird. I was reeling and I don't know. It just wasn't coming back to me. That's so weird. Huh. I don't know if I hit something or what. Huh. I don't know. It's strange. Alright, well there's another one. There's another one. Oh no, nice trout. Oh yeah, nice trout. He's barely hooked too. Holy cow, he's barely hooked. He's barely hooked, guys. Sheesh. Don't fail me now. Oh god, that's a nice one. That's a nice one, guys. Don't fail me now. Don't fail me now. Come on. Don't fail me now. Don't fail me now. Should I try and reach out and grab him or what? Don't fail me now. Please. Please, 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 please. Come here, come here, come here. Come here. Come here, don't fail me now. Don't fail me now. I'm just gonna grab it. Oh, look at that, guys. Yes, sir. Oh, that's a good one, guys. That is a good size. Jeez. That's gotta be 19 or 20. That's a solid trout. That is a solid trout right there. Jeez, and I barely had him too, guys. Oh my gosh, I barely had him. Nice. Let me get the bogus on him. Good deal. Nice fish. Healthy. Fat. Here we go, boys. All right, guys, it's no secret that gulp works. Really, there's no wrong way to fish gulp. The only bad thing about gulp is you can fish it uh, very crooked. If you fish it crooked, a lot of times what happens is it'll spiral in the water, and that's not what you want. So I got this screw lock here. This is a salty head screw lock. Uh, all you do is you get the nose and you screw it in straight, okay? Make sure it's straight. And then you get the hook and you measure it, okay? So I know more or less where it's going to go in. It's going to come out right there. So then you find it and you mark it. And then watch this, watch this. You ready? Then you twist it. And you go right where it needs to go, okay? Twist it, go right in where it needs to go, right there. In the belly slot and then comes out the middle like so and there you go and you make sure it's fishing straight let it go in the water pop it a few times and you see look at that fishing straight it's going up and down up and down that's what you want in the water up and down okay you don't want to go in or around in circles big spiral 
All right, then you just throw it out, let it sit, pop, pop. You're imitating a little bait fish that's just going up and down, or maybe a shrimp. You know, they don't care. Shrimp, bait fish, they don't care. They go on to eat if they're hungry. All right, man, I thought that was a. I thought that was a red man. He's a nice one. Nice one. I'd like to thank our sponsor, Sticky Pants, man. Making some awesome stringers. I actually borrowed my wife's today, so that's why it's pink. <laughs> Let's see what the boys are up to. Boys are coming this way. Let's see if I can catch another one right in front of their face. There's another one, guys, right in front of the boys, too. Right in front of the boys. Now they're gonna make fun of me. They said, is that a sardine? Let's go. I wanna be just like my captain. I just bring it back and then I measure it later. <laughs> One of them for sure is good, the other one I don't know. Uh, we're counting! Just like my captain. Captain, my captain. What? I'm just gonna put the mullet on a stringer. <laughs> what are you using? There's one, boys. There you go. Here's another one. We might found something here. All right, guys, the gulp strikes again. The little guy. There we go. Uh oh, got him right in the eye. Alrighty. Got this one in the eye. Oops. Sorry. Sorry about that. Pretty fish, guys. He's not big enough.
seen another one. Pretty fish. Real pretty. Probably, probably there. Nice little gulp hanging out the side there. Oh yeah. And the gulp falls out. Let's see what he's at. Man, he's fat, but I don't know if he's gonna make it. All right guys, we're too shy, so we're gonna let him go. Pretty fish though, a lot of girth. A lot of weight. We're gonna let him go. Let's get here in the front. Boys, girls, thank you so much for tuning in today. Uh, another episode of Fishing in Milligan. It was a great day. Hadn't been out in a while since the January video. You guys make sure to go back and check that one out. That was a lot of fun actually out of Port Mansfield. Uh, but if this is your first time tuning into this channel, guys, uh, consider subscribing, hitting the like button, and uh, we really appreciate all the help. Uh, leave a comment down below as to what kind of video maybe you guys would like to see next. But until next time, if you don't catch fish, it's all good. You can always fish again. See you guys. Peace. Okay, folks, thank you so much for tuning in to today's video. If you guys would like to try one of these murky water rods, there's a little secret. If you go on over to the FishFin app, by the way, use the code FISHAGIN1, uh, capital F, and you will get the whole year for free. That's right, for free. And then all you have to do is post a picture, tag murky water rods. There's my dog. <laughs> and you guys could win one of these. Be on the lookout for more really cool murky water rods coming this way. There's Lady Bird saying hi. Lady, come here. Hey girl, what you doing? <laughs> she likes murky water rods too, guys. All right, see you later, peace.